The North Yorkshire Moors are home to some of the largest stretches of unbroken heather moorland in Britain. From the air, purple patches dominate the landscape, but all this could now be under threat. Bracken suffocates any other plant or habitat in its way and grows 4% every year. The herbicide Ashelam has been used for decades to control the competitive plant, but the EU has now banned the chemical following concerns over its effect when used by spinach growers. This blanket ban means that bracken will outcompete everything in its path, including heather, the main diet of grouse. A huge blow to the economy and local gamekeepers. Oh, it's going it, to it eventually will affect, affect the local economy. Yeah. yeah. And it's not the bracken. It's not just the grouse shooting as well. It's yeah. it's the bird life, the curls, the lapwings, the merlins, also the sheep because the bracken nothing grows underneath the bracken, so there's no. going to be no grazing. So it's going to that's going to impact on the heather as well. 75% of the world's heather moorland lies here in the UK, the majority of it thriving on the North Yorkshire moors and also on the Cumbrian and County Durham border. Without Ajalam, it's estimated that we'd have already lost around half of that moorland and with that, a large majority of the local wildlife would have dwindled. Nicholas Hawkins Bias runs a company that sprays bracken with Ajalam. He stresses the importance of controlling bracken and hopes with government backing to begin reusing Ajalam before it's simply too late. Well, obviously we're talking to the government and we're talking to all our interested stakeholders, but we're up against a fairly inflexible European system which can't adapt to local needs and various other things. And this is one of the biggest problems we have here. You know, I think even people in Brussels recognise that we need to probably do something about this, but they haven't got the mechanisms to do it.